Hello everyone, using UAV for different aspects of the human life is becoming popular nowadays. UAV have direct and indirect influence on the human life, so they cover very wide range of application. I can tell you that from the pizza delivery to the movie industry, and even also sometimes they are using for the border security and inspection. In the meantime, outdoor insulators are one of the key factors in power engineering in that industry. Specifically, when we are talking about the power transmission line, so, or when we are talking about the transformer bushing. So having failure or defect in outdoor insulator will cause interruption in electricity delivery to the customers. In 2016, we have started a kind of project to perform inspection over outdoor insulator using UAVs. So in this project, we capture different static images or dynamic images, which of course dynamic images, we can call it video. So basically to monitor outdoor insulators. We use image processing and machine learning techniques to analyze static images and we have used deep learning techniques for evaluating the videos. Since UAVs are step-by-step -step facilitating with the internet, let's say 3G, 4G or in future 5G, our data collected by UAV would be transferred to the cloud for analysis and the feedback of the outdoor insulator quality would be sent to the operator mobile phone application. We believe that this technique can be replaced with conventional technique for power line inspection. Right now, I wanted to ask one of our team members to fly the UAV and give pretty close action to the outdoor insulator. Then you can see that how we are capturing actually the image. You can see that the UAV is coming forward, so and it is quite stable. So it means that it can simply get very high quality images or it can record actually simply high quality video without any kind of actually vibration. In the meantime, so uh, if I'm getting actually pretty close to the UAV, you will see that it's trying actually to move up because it can detect my hand and it is protecting against me. Therefore, this system is quite robust system. So basically to be used for the other insulator, insulator inspection. In the meantime, when the UAV is getting close, when the system is detecting some kind of obstacle and object, it is trying to stay at least two meters far away from, from, from the outdoor insulator. Therefore, so it is guaranteed that so the UAV is not getting damaged. However, let me tell you that there is a high voltage line here, and of course there is a huge amount of the current and electronic, electromagnetic wave from each and every conduct. This voltage and that electromagnetic wave can simply influence actually the UAV telecommunication system. Therefore, it is not recommended even the UAV get very close to the power line. So you can simply get the capture so of the images, so basically two meters far away, and the quality of that which is going to be enough to monitor the outdoor insulation. So one more thing which I'm going to highlight for you is to stand in the power line over the, the, the high voltage tower, usually we are getting 10 to 15, sometimes up to 30 meter actually distance. So this means that you maybe can simply fly around the insulator so, and, and get full uh, images uh, around the insulators vertically and of course, you know, basically horizontally. And in the meantime, collect a huge amount of the data for inspection. You know that when we are using deep learning techniques, we need to have huge amount of the data. So this technique will provide us huge amount of the data for smart analysis. So you know, uh, these days the researchers are working uh, to facilitate the UAV with the Internet of Things, as I told you in the last session. So when this UAV is getting facilitated with the Internet, it can, in real time, it can send the information over the cloud or it can send information directly to the mobile phone of the operator. Therefore, it would be very effective technique, so basically to monitor the outdoor insulator. Any kind of defects or pollution over the 